Welcome back to NC Bass, and today I'm on Lake Norman Tuesday tournament. Like usual, we did, a CBC and a B, BFL were just fished this past weekend, and the weights look very tough. I mean, 16 pounds one on Saturday and 14 something on Sunday. I mean, that's 200 boat BFL tournament, 14 pounds one. Most guys didn't have a limit. It looked, and I heard the fishing was really terrible, but I mean, it was post frontal, it was terrible conditions. This is a big tournament the day before that really hurts the lake. The lake's been getting hit hard, so it might make it really tough today. I'm not expecting to come out here and catch them real good, but the wind's gonna blow the right way. Southwest wind, 10 to 15 miles per hour later in the day, starting off about seven, eight, and that's gonna make it get really warm. I mean, it's supposed to get to like 62 today, which is really, it's like 31 right now. It's cold right now, but it's gonna get warm. About the time the tournament's over, eight to one, three fish limit. About the time it's over, they'll probably start biting. We haven't had a lot of sun lately, so I'm thinking after about 10 o'clock, that sun heating up these rocks, they'll push the fish up shallow. They might not start killing at first, but I think, I think they'll at least be up shallow where I can catch them. Water has gotten extreme. It's gotten way muddier. I mean, it's this. It's down to like a foot, maybe a foot of visibility. It's real dingy brown color. Perfect color for me. I know it's, it's going to be clear down lake. I think I'm going to try to find some new water. I'm going to start off on the bridge, of course. I'm going to go down where the mud line. I'm going to go down halfway down lake at least and see where the. It's been muddy all winter. I think a lot of these fish are down there on the southern, the south part of the lake. I'll be happy with the limit. Anything over six pounds, a three fish limit. I'll be happy to catch the limit because I know it could be tough after the lake's been hit so hard. A lot of pressure really makes this lake tough, but they might be biting. Pre spawn's about to start picking up. The bite's about to start picking up, so I'm hoping they're biting today. Let's see how it goes. And blast them. Fish on. No! I got, no, he's still on. He's a small. Boat's blasting off, already got one. That's why you start on the bridge, guys. The bridge <laughs> never fails. <laughs> oh, it's small, but he hammered it and then I didn't feel anything. As soon as I bounced off a rock. I mean, that's, is that the first cast curse, guys? I might have just started with the first cast curse. You're not supposed to catch one on the first cast, they say. But. Go Wesley, Boston! <laughs> yeah! Good luck, brother. You too, man! Oh, bridge fish. guys midday update i guess the first cast curse is true i mean that's the only bite i've got all day that first cast but i was up here where i can actually catch fish i went down all the way down to like the Beatty's ford ramp area governor's island area fish around there found some stuff that looked good but just never got a bite the water's still cold i thought it'd be warmer down there but it's still about the same temperature down there it's a lot colder than it was like two weeks ago i got it, i'm reading like 45 degree water temperature pretty much everywhere 46 47 at the most it's warming up though it, with the wind it still feels cold but it's warming up the sun is out i mean maybe i'll get the fish to bite there's a big mud line right before haggard creek going down the lake i mean it's it's pretty muddy up here where i'm at now but i'm gonna go back and fish where i'm, I'm used to fishing where i know where the, where the key spots to catch these fish i like fishing in the mud i should with the wind and the mud i should be able to crank and catch a few i'm hoping i can at least get a limit in the boat i mean it's tough right now out. Let's see how it goes. There's a fish. Oh my gosh. A fish. Are you kidding me? A fish. Finally. Thing's very big, but something. Actually, might be very big. I mean, guys, there's like 10 minutes to go. Not bad. Not a bad one. I'll just slip him. Not to lose him. A fish. Oh my gosh, guys, finally something. On the brush hog. 
baby brush hog, or brush hog junior, with a shaky head. Finally, it's a two pounder. I bet the bite's about to turn on, but the tournament's pretty much over. Oh my gosh, it has been a struggle, guys. When I had, when he bit it, I was like, no way that's actually a fish. Finally, something. 2.29. Got three that size, I've probably been happy with it. Look at that giant, guys. Forget what it was, it was five something. Well guys, it was a tough day for me. I just could not, I shouldn't make a video out of this, but can't catch them every tournament. I mean, the cold morning and the lakes has been hit hard the last weekend. I mean, I knew two big tournaments. I should have known it would be kind of a tough day, but I guess the first cast curse is true because I caught one on the very first cast and then just could not get a bite for five hours. And I finally caught one at the very end, but at least it was tough for a lot of guys, but Mike caught him, of course. He has a 10.6, I think, new Tuesday record with a 5.27 pound largemouth big fish. He wins a lot of the times. Larry was second with 6.78, I think. And somebody had five pounds and that was it. I'm not sure, I didn't even see how many boats we had. I think we had 20, 20 or so boats today, not many. Probably gonna come back here tomorrow. I'm not, I'm not for sure yet, but I think I'm gonna try to fun fish and figure out some patterns. Should've went way down lake, but I kinda wanna check out some stuff. I, I, need to, I need to practice more and find more areas instead of fishing the same old spots over and over. Couldn't really fish the 150 bridge. So many people were on the on the bridge this morning. I mean, so many people. Come back through, tried to fish it. A ton of people on it again. Never really got to fish the 150 bridge. I thought with the wind today they'd bite, but I was wrong. I mean, I'm sure they're biting somewhere. I mean, you can see, if you can find them, there's big fish biting if you can find them. I'll catch them next time, but thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on NC Bassin.